bell button. In this video, we are going to see about an example of closed loop system. So now, this is servo mechanism. Actually, there is a load. Its shaft is connected with the motor shaft through a gear system. So now, this motor is supplied by a generator. Now, the generator's field will be controlled through this system. Actually, the field winding of this motor is kept constant. It means the supply to the motor field is constant. So now we are going to vary the armature voltage of this motor. According to the armature voltage generated by this generator, motor speed will vary. So now we see this is a potentiometer. Actually, the resistance value of this and this A and B are same. It means when reference and actual, it means so here now this part will get the actual position of this load and it will generate the its position resistive position here. So now here we are going to fix a reference. So now if current position and reference position are same means this voltage source will deliver a current to both the resistance. The both the currents are same. Suppose this is IA, this is IB. So now both are same. It means here the reference value and actual value both are same means error equal to 0. So here IF also 0. This will not generate any voltage. It means motor will not run. Suppose if the position of this load to be changed means so now its resistive value either increase or decrease. Depends upon the position to be changed. The resistive value may increase or decrease. So now accordingly here error will be generated. This amplifier will amplify the error signal and will give to the field winding of this generator. So according to the field, this generator will vary its generated voltage that will be supplied to the motor. So now motor will rotate when the load position is reached the reference value. So now this resistance value, this resistance value will be same at the time current through both the resistance are same. Here error is zero. Here IF also 0, there is no voltage generated by generator, the motor will stop running. So this is an example of closed loop system.